characters of all time are coming to the big screen at last. Oh, why'd you come in? From the filmmakers that brought you the runaway box office hit Chicken Run. Let's rock and roll! Aardman and DreamWorks Animation are collaborating for a feature-length adventure starring the dynamic duo Wallace and Gromit. Wallace and Gromit are a global phenomenon whose short films have garnered two Academy Awards and have been translated into over 20 languages. Creator and Oscar winner Nick Park is teaming up with Steve Box to direct the wildly embedded film. Oh, very cheeky. It just feels great to finally get one from it out there on the big screen. Like, it's been one of those really long numbers for me I've had that for many, many years. But, off we go then. Wallace is a good-natured, eccentric, cheese-loving inventor. I'm just crackers that love cheese. Grommet, his faithful canine companion, doesn't express itself in words, but his body language speaks volumes. There's a good dog. The adventure begins in a small town in England, where the townspeople are preparing for their giant vegetable competition. It's a veritable vegetable paradise. Wallace and Grommet are called into action to investigate reports of a mysterious garden goblin beast. I feel we're on the cusp of a real breakthrough life. The whole humor of it all is that it's all in this little cozy northern town and uh, uh, you know, cups of tea and crackers and peas. But it, uh, it just grows exponentially from there and becomes a kind of a mega adventure. Oh, charming. It's no small task for the creative team to bring the delightful duo to life. From sets to wardrobe to facial expressions, every detail, the unique animation style is tailored to create the fantastic world of Wallace and Gromit. All in a night worth the devote. Alongside a host of new characters, the movie features Ray Fonz as the pompous snob, Victor Quarterman. No nonsense, the Victor Quarterman. What you see is what you get. Helena Bonham Carter plays Lady Totterton, an aristocrat who harbors a secret crush on Wallace. Please, boss. Call me Toppy. Well, I've always been a fan of Wilson Gromit, and I've always loved them. And they've got such sweet hearts. Oh, oh thanks, Chuck. Uh... You'll go crackers for the embedded world of Wallace and Gromit. Only in theaters, October 2005. Just well done, man. <laughs>